Look at this beautiful play call by the Pacers. McDermott goes down low to set a pick for Justin Holiday, and Holiday starts sprinting outside. As the defender bites on it, Holiday comes back so that he is the actual screen man for McDermott, who goes in the opposite corner. The open look is secured by another screen right here, and this three pointer goes in. That was a great design by Indiana, and I have 5 more to show you. What up everybody, my name is Stefan and this is Heat Check. Let's get into it. The Lakers ran Avery Bradley from the corner, past this first screen and the second one, so that when he gets the ball on the handoff, Bradley has the angle on his defender and it's now a 3 on 2 situation. Siakam has to get up on him, but then the second defender has to make a decision. Drop down with Howard or not leave Anthony Davis open for the 3. He chooses the latter, which opens up the lob and the strong finish on this alley-oop. And speaking of lobs, here's another beautiful design by the Suns. Kelly Oubre starts in the corner, gets a screen and goes full speed to set a pick himself. Only thing is, he actually slips it. And now Oubre is a full step in front of Kyrie, curls around Kaminsky and goes airborne to put an exclamation mark to this great play. Check out what it means to have Nikola Jokic on your team. He brings the ball up and goes toward the right wing ready to hand it off to Gary Harris. And look at the poetry in motion here. No pass, Harris keeps moving, curls to the basket and an absolutely phenomenal pass by Jokic with some spin on it for a great finish. Absolutely amazing. The Sixers pull the fast one on the Hornets. Watch this. As Mike Scott goes to set a pick for Furkan Korkmaz, you can see Bridges is already looking behind, as everything points to a double screen for Korkmaz to come out and take the shot. And with everyone expecting exactly that, it was quite easy for the Turkish international to just cut to the basket and get a layup on this possession. And finally, here's a nice option play from the Milwaukee Bucks. Lopez hands it off to George Hill and goes down low where Matthews is going to screen for him. And you can see the nice inside position that Lopez has here. And as you can notice, if there's a switch or a double team, which in this case the Thunder defense kind of does none of those things, but if it was to happen, Matthews sprints to the 3 point line, has a screen from Ilya Sova, the pass can go here and an open look from 3. But in this case, the 2 points inside were worked out just fine for them. And there you have it. By the way, just a disclaimer, I'm not a coach or anything like that, so a lot of these plays probably can be easily recognizable or have proper names, but I don't know those names, you know, I'm not doing these videos for the highly educated basketball minds who probably are laughing right now. I just want to show you guys what I see on the court, that's how I can help some of you guys and that's how I can actually teach myself to notice things better on the court. Anyway, enough of that, let me know if I should show the whole video after the breakdown. I feel like it's good to see the whole video just flow in one motion without being chopped up but if you feel like it's being repetitive let me know by replying to my pinned comment down in the comment section this is a test version and i'll experiment more if you like this style that's it for now if you like this video subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you don't miss my future in-depth analysis talk to you in the next one peace out